रिभु गीता चैप्टर थर्टी थ्री रिभु सेस आई टेल यू द सुप्रीम ब्रह्मन अलोन इज दिस वर्ल्ड इज अनजेनरेटेड आई एम ओनली द स्टेट ऑफ बीइंग एंड ब्लेस दिस वर्ल्ड इज अनजेनरेटेड आई एम ओनली द सेल्फ द सुप्रीम ब्रह्मन नॉट द वर्ल्ड दैट इज सीन एज सेपरेट आई एम ओनली द स्टेट ऑफ बीइंग एंड ब्लेस दिस वर्ल्ड इज अनजेनरेटेड आई एम ओनली द स्टेट ऑफ बीइंग एंड ब्लेस I am the embodiment of the state of awareness and bliss. I alone am. I alone am the only one. I alone am higher than the highest. Being consciousness bliss, the one am I. Indeed, Brahman alone. I am ever resplendent. Such a form from wherever is unreal. You, this much is the supreme Brahman, the form full of consciousness and bliss. the form of consciousness the expanse of consciousness consciousness alone is the supreme joy i am only the self not the unreal i am the established the supreme guru there is no time there is no world either either only erroneous conception i alone am the supreme brahman i alone am the ever existent shiva I am only pure awareness the experience of pure serenity I am only non-dual bliss I am inexhaustible I am the great one all is always only brahman all is only always blemishless brahman all is brahman and not else all is brahman the sentient I am of the form of the all illuminating I am indeed the mind adorable to all I shine alone I am without the attained and the unattained I am of the form of the indweller of all with the characteristic of the all witnessing it is certain that I am of the form of quiescence inquiry and joy I am the supreme self the transcendental light the beyond and bereft of any other I am of the nature of the all full I am the ineffable and the supreme self I am of the nature of the Veda and the consciousness of all the scriptures. I am of the nature of the bliss of the world, the definition of the essential happiness. All is indeed Brahman. There is no world. Brahman is the cause of all. All is only Brahman. There is nothing purposeless. All is Brahman itself the best. I am the ever decayless. I am the eternal bestower of auspiciousness to all. I am the light of reality and knowledge I am the embodiment of the highest knowledge I shine as the fourth and other than the fourth state I am bereft of accomplishments non accomplishments and the like all is brahman always all is brahman ceaselessness all is brahman the space of consciousness the eternal brahman the taintless all is brahman transcending qualities all is just brahman all is only brahman achieve this certitude always brahman is everything be of this conviction always all is brahman with this certainty be joyous all is always brahman being and non being are consciousness only there is no scope for arguments none whatsoever about duality or non duality here there is no doubt about this I am only absolute knowledge it is certain that all is brahman i am he more mysterious than the most mysterious i am above qualities and without a second investigate into the comparisons and contrasts and actions and inactions of things i am of the form of being awareness bliss this world is ungenerated Brahman alone is all of this this world is expanse of consciousness Brahman alone is the supreme bliss the lord akin to all pervasive space Brahman is indeed existence knowledge bliss ever unapproachable by speech Brahman alone is all of this some say it is some say it is not even an iota of bliss is real and unreal as well Brahman alone is all this always just real indeed Brahman alone is all of this a mass of consciousness and bliss embodiment Brahman alone is being and reality I am the ancient and the great 
Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, stationed as the warp and woof. Brahman is indeed existence awareness bliss, the forum of all and the ancient. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the undiminishing supreme bliss. Brahman is indeed existence awareness bliss, transcending the delusive pray power of Maya and taintless. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, simply existence, joy of joys. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss of the nature of unitary consciousness. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, bereft of all distinctions. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, abiding here as manifold forms. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the subject and circumstance as well. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss of the nature of transcendental light. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, eternal, motionless and undiminishing. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the, front, the frontier of words, the essence that is. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the one self, ever the one self. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, doing nothing nor standing still. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, neither going nor staying. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss. There is nothing in the least apart from Brahman. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, neither fair nor dark. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the substratum of all and inexhaustible. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, neither quiet nor garrulous. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, neither you nor I nor anything in the least. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, beyond the beyond ungenerated. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, beyond the tattvas, the 24 cosmic principles, the grand celebration. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the supreme wide expanse. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, always in the form of the Guru. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, ever the blemishless form. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the vast and pure consciousness. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the self shining by itself. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the certitude and the cause of itself. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, shining by itself. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, manifest as the man, the manifold. Brahman alone is the form of being awareness of the nature of the seat of the delusion. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, all is not non-existent for me. Be Brahman is beyond the expression of words, the embodiment of being awareness bliss. I am the form of being awareness bliss. This world is never generated. Brahman alone is this, always real, eternally free and taintless. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the only one ever joyous. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, more perfect than the most perfect and the great. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the all-pervading Lord. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, luminous with name and form. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the pure and endless joy. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, the bestower of the highest joy. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, just being beyond real and unreal. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, transcending all and undiminishing. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss of the form of liberation, the auspicious and inauspicious. Brahman is indeed being awareness bliss, not in the least limited whatsoever. Brahman is all of this, pure, enlightened and stainless. I am of the form of the being awareness bliss. This world is unmanifest. This chapter is the truth and the bestower of instantaneous liberation. It is the remover of all forms of sorrow and the giver of complete knowledge, bringing about perennial joy, truly the giver of peace and self-control. One whose heart is like the honey bee 
constantly engaged in the enjoyment of the lotus feet of the great lord the killer of death at whose stainless and divine feet celestials in multitudes bow in veneration and who is the sole cause of creation he called he shall become worthy of his grace thus concludes chapter 33 entitled topic of the forum of being awareness bliss in the sixth amsha called shankara of shri shiva rahasyam om namah shivaya